as all of us are aware, late Steve Jobs was not someone who believed in contemporary ideas and methods when creating products, be it at Apple or the Walt Disney Company. He was revolutionary as an entrepreneur, marketer, and inventor and wore more hats than just these, having received a number of Honors for his futuristic and visionary works like iMac, iPod, iPhone, Toy Story, etc. There is lots to learn from him. Here are four lessons entrepreneurs should learn from Steve Jobs. 1. Experts can only talk but not design products. Steve Jobs was not a very big fan of the so-called experts. He truly believed in his designs and products and hence he never listened to experts. Experts listened to him. For whatever he placed in front of them, they would consider it state of the art. Just like this, even entrepreneurs too should believe in their ideas and irrespective of what the experts say, continue to develop the product and aim at being the best. Our goal is to make the best devices in the world, not to be the biggest. 2. Be very particular about design. We live in a world where many rave about price. Brands get into price wars too. What is more important than that is to create the right design. If you have the right design, customers are ready to pay that kind of price. The best example being of the iPhone. Steve Jobs was very particular about the designs of his products and campaigns. Not a speck here or there, he craved for perfection in whatever he designed. Likewise as an entrepreneur too, be very particular about the design. Right from creation of brand image to the final product. Make sure everything is just the way you had envisioned it. Design is not just what it looks like and feels like. Design is how it works. Furry. Intelligent souls do change their mind. Steve Jobs always believed in the power of conviction. He would author big VPs and board of directors to believe in his ideas. He also followed the fundamental principle that consumers do not know what they want unless you show it to them. Likewise he applied the same principle towards several intelligent souls he would have to convince before launching a product. To an extent, he often would give demos himself. It may not be perfect, but he wanted to take the responsibility. Likewise even entrepreneurs should believe that if they truly believe in their idea then convincing board of directors or venture capitalists for funding or other approvals may not be too hard to Everything around you that you call life was made up by people that were no smarter than you and you can change it. Far in simplicity lies your greatest asset. All of Steve Jobs' work had one thing in common simplicity. His designs were simple, his products were simple, and all his methods provided simple solutions to complicated problems. Every single Apple innovation was crafted beautifully with simplistic designs and mostly the use of purest form of color white. As an entrepreneur, one must focus on keeping it simple too. If you have developed a product, keep the usage and application of the same simple. If you are offering a service, keep the acquisition of it simple. That's been one of my mantras, focus and simplicity. Simple can be harder than complex. You have to work hard to get your thinking clean to make it simple. But it's worth it in the end, because once you get there, you can move mountains.